So it's me, Isabella, and today I have a haul video for you guys. This is a fall slash winter haul. And part of it's my Black Friday haul. So yeah, I think I'm gonna put the stuff I got from another for other people in another video because they it'll be kind of split apart. So, I guess let's get into it. Disclaimer, I'm not trying to brag, I'm just, I like watching these videos. I know my friends like watching these videos. I know a ton of people who like watching these videos. So if you don't like this, these types of videos, just make it disappear. But I really do, and 99.9% of this was purchased with my own money, and I earned that money, and it wasn't just like, yeah, so. I like feel like I've earned this stuff kind of but um yeah and I'm not trying to brag or anything and so I'll get into it. The first place that I went was Target a while ago. Before when I went I got these black flats and they just have these little bows on them which have these gold little aglets on them and they're just by the brand Morona. And I've worn them a few times, a lot of them just look like that. They don't really have a heel or anything. But I've never had a pair of flats before and I thought these fit really nicely and they're super cute. So I got them and they were like 15 bucks I think, which is not bad at all. And the got from there was I got some more skincare stuff. So I kind of have like a mini Willa skincare haul kind of thing going on, but anyway. So I got some skincare things and I was running out of face wash and moisturizer and acne stuff and I've used this all before and I'm repurchasing it and okay so this brand Willa, Willa Skincares, um, she, this girl is like my age, she's like 13 or 14, she makes the most amazing skincare products, they work so well, they're really not that expensive and she Oh my god, they smell so good. So I would really recommend checking these out. If you want some good skincare things. So I got the Willa Naturals Start Fresh Foaming Face Wash. Which is like my fire, my by far favorite face wash. Favorite, my favorite face wash ever. And it is just like, oh my gosh. It is the best thing the company makes in my opinion. I, if you just get one thing from them, I would recommend getting the face wash. Uh, the next thing I got is the face friendly clear moisturizer and it just looks like this and it is like the bomb.com I mean it's I wouldn't recommend this if you have really oily skin because it does come out in an oil consistency like here I'll so it is like consistency of an oil kind of thing and you just rub it in so if you have oily skin this probably is not the best for you but I have really really dry skin so it works fine for me the last thing I got from that company is the Willa take action acne spot treatment pen it just looks like this and it, this is seriously amazing it you just dab it on your acne and then like within a few hours your acne is either dramatically shrunk or gone so I mean my friend she tried this and she didn't think it worked that well for her but it works really well for me so it just depends on your skin type but I'm pretty sure she has more oily skin than I do so I guess I'll go with what I got at Target today first thing I got is the Pixar Monsters University Blu-ray and the next movie I got is The Great Gatsby. I got is the new Selena Gomez album. And all my friends know I seriously like love Selena Gomez. I went to her in concert and I will upload a video of what I wore to the concert because that it was like seriously the most amazing night of my life. It was to it was so so good. So the next thing that I got from Target is just this sweater and it just looks like this 
it just looks like this and it's just this cream colored cable knit sweater and I've really been wanting one of these for like forever and this was $25 and I saw it and I really liked it when it was full price but I didn't have the money then because I'm mostly broke all the time until recently so yeah I didn't get that then but it was $14 today so I snatched it right up and I will definitely be rocking that a lot so the next place I went was Ulta and I got a lot of things for other people here so check out my next video that will probably be up which is what I'm giving for Christmas like it's not a complete list of everything I'm getting for people for Christmas but I know I definitely need to watch these videos to get gifts for my friends and so these will be really helpful but I got a mirror for my for my desk because I don't have a mirror to do my makeup in currently so I just do it in the bathroom but I really wanted something that I could put at my desk and in the morning I could just sit at my desk and do my makeup. So this was $15 at Ulta which is a really great deal for a mirror like this because it's got a t magnifying side and a normal side and it's just silver and they have bedazzled ones but I didn't really like the bedazzled ones so I just got the sculpted stem but this is seriously like I'm going to use this so often it's so worth $15 because I don't know how much this is normally but mirrors are really expensive like seriously I got the snow angel shampoo shower gel and bubble bath by philosophy and oh my gosh okay this is just what it looks like let's just look at that for a minute that's freaking amazing and this is actually a lot of it it's 16 ounces and this smells so good oh my gosh it smells amazing. It smells like my shampoo, but sweeter, which is coconut orchid. So this is definitely a really good buy, and I would even recommend buying this at full price. I don't know how much this is, but ten dollars for this seems really cheap. So, because I'm pretty sure these are normally like sixteen or twenty. I don't know. I don't normally buy philosophy things because they are kind of expensive, and I don't normally find a scent that I like, but. I liked this one. Yeah, I ordered some things off of Macy's thing I got, which I haven't worn yet because I'm gonna DIY this a little bit. But it is just the Teen Vogue for my style lab um, long camo jacket. And it is so cool because it looks like camo, but really it's butterflies. Like how cool is that? It's so cool. But the one thing that I'm not really a big fan of is it's got these rhinestones on the shoulders. So I'm just going to take those off. And it looks so cute when those aren't on there. And it covers your butt so you can wear it with leggings. And this is really light and it's surprisingly warm. So this will definitely be getting a lot of wear. The next thing I got is this army green vest also from Teen Vogue for my style ad and it just cinches at the waist and it's got pockets and then it's got these skull detail oh, skull details so I already wore this to the Hunger Games movie with a bunch of my friends and I thought it was really great for that because I didn't even need to carry a purse with me I mean I did but I didn't, I didn't really need to. Like, I could have gone without a purse and it would have been okay. So next, I got this Bath & Body Works. I got three candles, just the mini candles. And I got them in Tis the Season, Sparkling Icicles, and Marshmallow Fireside. And they all smelled so amazing. And I wish I could have gotten them all, but I only had like $10 or maybe $11. But I'll explain to you what the scents smell like. So, Sparkling Icicle basically smells like mahogany teak wood, just like better. So, it basically smells like an amazing Abercrombie. And it is a fresh citrus bouquet with bergamot and a touch of holiday moss. It just literally smells like Abercrombie, but better. So, if you have a chance to go smell this, I'd really recommend smelling it because 
it's so amazing. So next candle I got, which is probably my least favorite, is the Tis the Season candle. And this is definitely a candle dupe. So you can get like the Febreze candles or whatever, and this is definitely, they have dupes of this candle. I'm 100% sure because my science teacher sprays this nasty apple cherry stuff like in the room and her whole room smells like this and I didn't even realize it until I got home but it's just this tis the season candle and it says it smells like cider with all the joys of the holidays and green pine red apples green pine cider holidays this smells like cherry apple spice that's what this smells like. So if you like that smell, I mean, it smells a little bit better, but it's not. I would definitely not recommend getting a three wood candle, but because I know that sounds going to drive me crazy pretty soon. My favorite candle, though, by far, I'm definitely going back to get the three wick, is the Bath and Body Works Marshmallow Fireside. This candle, I've already burned it, but oh my god, it smells so amazing. It's marshmallow with vanilla with smoldering woods this is literally like if my whole house could smell like this i would like buy whatever because this is so amazing it smells like just to die for this is the end of my haul i know it's not that huge because mainly i've been buying things for the holidays for other people lately so yeah this will that'll be up on this channel in a second video and I have to apologize you guys for not uploading videos really recently I've had a lot of really crazy school and I'm so thankful that you guys are subscribed to me and stuff and no one's really like unsubscribed or anything but we I've just had a crazy school like year so far and it's only November and a lot of stuff is happening with a lot me and a lot of my friends and I've just needed to be there for a lot of people and a lot of people have needed to be there for me and it has just not worked out that I have had any free time at all to film a video. So this is my first chance and I hope you guys enjoy it and I hope you guys really like this because I do this for you. It's vlogging for me but mainly for you and I hope you guys enjoy and keep on watching my videos. So if you're not already, like, comment, and subscribe. And I think when I hit 50 followers, you guys will get a room tour. If you want to see a room tour, you better subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!